Hey guys, how's it going today? I'm Omar Morales. I recorded a whole video yesterday. I uh, went to the flea market, um, farmer's market in Montclair. And I was gonna post that video, but I decided, you know what? It's Father's Day today here in the States. Happy Father's Day to everyone across the world, not just here in the States. Um, but like I said, I wanted to take a walk today anyway. So I figured why not record while I'm out here today? The minute I started recording, was because there was a catbird in the area and it was doing its meowing which is why they call it a catbird it, it has the ability to mimic a lot of birds have mimicking abilities catbird is one of them so it was doing a crying cat meowing so i wanted to capture that for you guys for those who have never heard a catbird but the minute i hit record it decided it was done talking so I didn't get to capture anything. So I'm here in the marshes again today and it's, it's, a, it's a dry marshy day. Let me see, show you here. You can see how dry the marshes are today. Uh, it's a very low tide here. So I was hoping to see a, a blue heron or something like that today, but based on the water levels, probably not going to find much and you know it's already you know into the early morning well, past the early morning right so even the bird sounds have died off I'm just here walking basically and enjoying it so a lot of birds out here uh, of the common variety and they're just having fun flying around getting food and worms no robins again I, I miss my robins I love I love photographing a robin every time I start my day with the camera I like to get a robin but for some reason here in Sea Caucus they've been few and far between do you guys celebrate um, a Father's Day in your country if you're not from the States part of the old charm of walking here in the Sea Caucus Marsh is this old bridge here it's been around as long as this park's been around it's weathered it's tempered it looks like it could collapse any day now actually it doesn't look that bad but I love coming here because uh, during certain times of the year, there's a wonderful level of here. Let me see if we can get it. Take a look at here. There's a wonderful mini stream that's created. And you can see here the, the water flowing in this area here. It usually is, you know, a little higher tide. And what happens is on this side of the bridge, you'll have herons parked here while the water flows this way and they'll just sit there and start fishing the entire time they're here so it's always a good capture right now all we got is a couple of ducks which we can't focus on with this little dji pocket but they're right here on this little log there's a bunch of ducks sleeping um, and some other ducks over yonder not much out here today though but it's not about what's out here today it's more important that that we are out here walking and we're getting our steps in and we're keeping the body young because like we always say like i always say the older i get the harder that stuff becomes for me so i'm out here to enjoy the walk and make you guys uh deal with my oldness all right be right back so it was a good walk um got a couple of videos that i i shot just to get used to shooting videos because i want to get better at focusing on these birds, bees, whatever it is, and, and filming them to add it to my repertoire. The only problem is, I, like I said earlier, I had my um, image stabilization set to the wrong setting. So I'm sure when I get back home, I'll see there was a lot of misses because of shakiness or just, uh, you know, unprofessional, unprofessionally being unprepared. Luckily, I don't do this professionally. I was uh, a cat bird right there and I'm trying to get it to meow for you guys but it's being a complete jerk doesn't want to say anything can't force them they're nasty birds too mockingbirds cat birds they can be very aggressive territorial and uh, push you out of the way if you they think you're in their environment but thank you so much for coming along for this quiet quick walk Hope you have, that's a beautiful red bird. What is that? That's a small red bird. I don't 
think I've seen that before. The size of a barn swallow, I just startled a morning dove. The size of a barn swallow, but it was bright red, orangey. Oh, I found a heron. I'm gonna go photograph the heron. Be right back. I was gonna say goodbye, but I just saw this heron. I gotta, gotta go photograph it. Not sure if my mic is picking that up. That's a catbird. You hear that? All right, that was it. I wanted you guys to hear it. But let's go find this heron. Of course, I get to a spot where I thought I would have the best vantage to see, oh my, hello sir, to see this heron. And uh, unfortunately, I was wrong. I, I thought I would be able to see it here in this clearing here. Um, I should have tried photographing it from like over there using the X-T5's 50 megapixels to crop in later on because it's completely gone now and I missed it. But I did record a robin, right? I was looking for a robin. So we got one. So, all right, I'm gonna walk out of the park now. I think I've done enough walking for today. Thank you so much guys for keeping me company on this lovely Father's Day. And until next time, enjoy your day. Don't let them boss you around at least today, all right? Be good, stay strong, stay positive, always love, respect the beard. Get yourself a walk and enjoy Father's Day.